Hello Trophy Club. I am Jeanette, this is Tiffany, and this is Kelly, and we are here to get you excited about the Trophy Club Parade of Patriots 2016, and that is July the 4th. And how can you participate? You can be a, you can enter a float. But let me get, let me tell you the real essence of July the 4th Parade in Trophy Club. It is a celebration day for all of Trophy Club, people who visit, family, friends, and it starts early in the morning with a marathon. And by the way, it's a 5K. Hey, it's a 5K, not a marathon. It's a 5K. And you, and you know what happens before all of that? The whole entire community gets involved in planting flags all over Trophy Club for the Trophy Club Stars and Stripes. That launches the Parade of Patriots on July the 4th. And how can you be a part of it? How can they be a part of it? <laughs> you can be a part of it by going to Facebook, Stars and Stripes, and what? You can find us on Facebook at TC Stars and Stripes, and you can find more information on the town website. You can also email us at tcstarsandstripes at gmail.com. Um, we are seeking volunteers for flag planting, which they'll plant on the second, uh, be picked up on the 5th so if you're interested in doing a, a route or a neighborhood or an HOA email us so that we can get you down and get you more information on that and that's and, it and if you have questions about the parade you need to contact Sherry Lewis at Parks and Recreation in Trophy Club the town of Trophy Club Sherry let's see you <laughs> Sherry Lewis yes hi Sherry hi Trophy Club now what can you expect at the parade this year it opens with a color guard. Then we have the Grand Marshal, who's our very own Casey Bershears, a Lieutenant Colonel in the Army. And then we also have a. We will have bagpipes. We will have the Boy Scouts. We will have the Women's Club. We will have kickball, bocce ball, um, karate, hopefully. Yeah, karate, <laughs> hopefully. Um, various HOAs. Let's talk about the HOA. Every year for the last three years, we've had one entry from an HOA. Oh, and it's not Turnberry. And it's not Hoggins Glen. And it's not the lake. It's the no. And you know what? Every year they win because no one's competing with it. But they always have these beautiful floats. You just can't believe. So we want to encourage HOAs to participate. And a parade application is on our Facebook page, uh, TC Stars and Stripes. Yes. It's at the very top. Yes. And let's not forget the real participants are who we really honor in this parade. And who is it that we really want to honor in our parade? That's our veterans and all that have served and are currently serving. And so therefore, that typically always in the past, for the last four years, the VFW Roanoke veterans have always kind of led our parade. And this year we're really going to be including many more mm -hmm. Trophy Club veterans. So we're very excited. So if you are a veteran, who do you contact to participate? You can contact Jim Paro or uh, again myself, Kelly, at starsandstripes at gmail.com. TC stars and stripes <laughs> at gmail.com. That's okay. You just contact Sherry Lewis. Or Sherry Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> so get out, be a part, be a participant and bring your family, friends, children, aunts, uncles, anybody to the parade on July the 4th. And what time does the parade begin? 9.30. 9.30. And it starts with a 5K that kicks off at 7.15. And Tiff not a marathon? And Tiffany <laughs> is not a marathon, but you know what? Tiffany came in second last year. In my age group? In her age group. <laughs> and, and you know what? I would like to just say, because this is for the Patriots and because this town is really committed to flags. So one thing that we introduced last year that I would like to encourage everybody to do, and that is when the flag, when the color guard walks in front of you, you stand and honor our American flag. Thank you very much. See you on the 4th. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Check it out, there's a coyote on their front porch patio. Where?